Yo koso, Japanese Quest away. Welcome to Japanese Quest. I am Akira Sensei, and today our day, our today our quest continues into Breath of the Wild and into the Japanese language. I'm a Japanese teacher in the U.S., and this channel is all about learning Japanese from Japanese games. For example, this guy, perhaps. Let's see if he has something to say. The verb down there. We've already learned and added to our power level. Our power level right now is 575. All the words we've learned so far. 575. And all those words show up down here during the stream. As kind of a chronicle of our journey, plus a way to increase your power level in Japanese. For example, you might see a word like ki tree. It's written in romaji as well, so anyone can read it, or most people can read it. And then you can learn a new word. Here we have hanasu, to talk. So let's talk to this guy. Uwa? <laughs> ah, well this. Konnichiwa. Genki desu ka? He says, Uwa, matta, omae ka? Oh, so he says it's you again. So I guess he remembers that we talked to him before. Ah, Greg, konbanwa. Hey, Greg, I saw you join the Discord. Welcome to the Discord as well. If anyone wants to, to chat and uh, trade Japanese resources or just hang out after stream, we have a Discord linked on the Twitch page as well. So check out the Discord if you want to go there. Lots of people link resources and other things about Japanese there. Um, people can ask Japanese questions there as well, and people can help answer those questions. All right, got it. Konnichiwa. Mina, genki desu ka? Watashi wa genki desu. I'm doing well, and we can ask him again. Nanisha no, what are you doing? So a lot of people probably know this word at least, even if they don't have a lot of Japanese experience. If they have meme experience on the internet, you've probably seen this one. Nani? Meaning what? And then shiteru. Sudu means to do. So if you say nani shiteru no, you're asking what are you doing? What are you doing? Using the te form with a ru after it shows the verb in action, something that you're doing. That, for example, I'm eating, I'm drinking, I'm doing, so what are you doing? Nani? Yeah, maybe you've heard it. I, I've heard this a, re a lot recently. It's interesting because I didn't used to hear it, and I used to teach this in my Japanese classes too, but omae wa mo shindeiru. But it seems like it's very well known now. You are already dead. And then the res response, Nani? Ore wa kore kara kono saki ni iru mamono wo toubatsu shi ni ikunda. Okay, so we saw this guy already. He's saying that he came here to fight the monsters uh, in the Colosseum up ahead. So yeah, he looks straight at his opponent, not averting his eyes, and fights. So he focuses on them. Yeah, it's become a meme. It's interesting how that's caught on so much as a meme. Because I used to teach it, and I didn't feel like it was a meme, even just like, I don't know. Like something like 10 years ago. Or even like five years ago, I didn't see as much. I'm glad it has, though. Because you get some good Japanese out of that sentence. Like, and nani as well. Ooh, bingo ga ippai arimasu. Well, it says, I think I'll get back to learning my hiragana while you're streaming. I could have finished yesterday, but I have lots of studies too. Yeah, well, this, you could do both too. A lot of people do uh, Anki as well as watching at the same time. So yeah, good to see you again, Weldis. Good to hear your studying is going well in Tunisia. Hiragana is a definitely good first step. If you're serious about learning some Japanese. You can read a lot more then and start learning more words. Good to see you again. So today I was thinking, um, Gade says I watched the VOD yesterday. 
you left it on for about an hour after streaming. Oh no, did I? <laughs> oh wow, I, yeah, I, I do that sometimes. Whoops. Hopefully there wasn't anything foolish there. Yeah, sometimes it gets left on, but I, I cut it off when I do the highlight, and that's what actually gets saved, because the VOD gets deleted eventually. But, uh, thanks for telling me. Got it. Yeah, it was a long video anyway, right? Uh, ooh, do we have a shrine over here? Yeah, sometimes it's easy to remember forgetting to turn off, like after hosting someone, it's easy to forget turning off OBS. But it doesn't really matter, no one's really gonna watch that anyway. I mean, it wasn't actually on Twitch, right? Like, I know it's on the VOD, but it wasn't streaming at the time. It's weird how that does that. You think it should just stop if it's not being broadcasted. Are we gonna... Yeah, we, we need to use a, a wooden bow. Uh, I watched a VOD yesterday. Uh, okay. You're talking about a streamer that streams early in the morning. Okay. Ah! Sodasne, yeah, did not stop the stream properly. Yeah, it's not a big deal, though. Like, I hosted someone, so, like, live, it's not like I was still streaming. It's just on the VOD. No one's really going to see that anyway. It doesn't really matter. Um, and, Greg, you were watching the VOD as well. <laughs> nice. Yeah, all the VODs are there. They're not all on YouTube right away, but they'll be put on YouTube eventually as well. Ah, Bunai. And yeah, Greg Pro, falling asleep, falling asleep during the stream. That's fine too. You can get some, uh, hopefully hear some Japanese in your sleep. <laughs> I know there's a lot of videos just on YouTube that are just for that. They're for like learning Japanese while you're sleeping. I don't know if that really works. I don't think it probably would too much. Need more arrows. Looks like we found a shrine here. Let's see if we can get in there without dying. Konnichiwa, Neko-san. Hai, ikimashou. Shirabaru. Let's investigate. And so, for everyone just joining, let's look at our current power level. It's 575, so it's pretty high. It's almost 600. Let's try to find some new words today that we can add with that. Uh, for example, maybe words right here. What words do we have here? Uh, didn't look like we really had any good ones for our power level there. But let's look for more in a minute here. Ooh, what do we have here? Hokaro Otorazi. You who have visited the, the uh, shrine, Oke, Okinachi Kara, so a large power. Hmm. What is it talking about there, I wonder? This one looks a little involved. Naruhodo. Koreo Tsukaimashou. Hmm, that did not work. Kind of seems like this is where it's going, though. Utsu to fire. So let's shoot off our power here. There we go. That is strange. I don't want to get killed by that thing. Ah, kore wa... Abunaya's net. This looks a little dangerous. Hmm. Omo 
should I? Who would design a shrine like this? All right. I think we can get through here now. Maybe. Omoshiroi. Ooh, we have a friend. Got a guardian knife, knife, guardian knife, and here we have a Kodai no Hakuruma, ancient spear, an ancient spring, bonnet spring, and we need some fire. It looks like. Higa itsuyo desu ne, hiraku. Let's see what we have here. Eh, Mushin no Taiken. This is a strong two-handed sword. It looks like. Check it out. Shikazoku no motsu katana tsukuri no gijutsu o yoha no ken ni. So it's a double bladed sword made by with sh the Shika swordsmith. Mochita mezrashi buki. So it's a rare blade. Ryoha no ken no atsukai ni. Narete nai hairaru no kishi no tame ni tsukuraita. All right. Interesting. Okay, so uh, what are people saying? Did you get the champion's weapon when you beat the bird holy beast yesterday? Yes, we did. We got a new one. Uh, let me show it to you. I'm not sure if I can show it to you unless I get attacked. Uh, Okamijin, at Okamijin, well, this says, I could read the enakata part. How do you read the other ones? I think there's verb to win, katsu. Uh, well, this if you don't have a, a tool to read online, I recommend getting a plugin like Rikai-kun, uh, so you can just read things online. It helps a lot, so then you can sound things out. So yeah, Haishin stream, and then Tadu. So he was saying I didn't stop my stream the other day. Uh, even though it did stop on Twitch, it kept streaming from my software, so it's still on the, the video. Um, but yeah, I recommend getting a tool. Let's take a look at the browser cam for a second. Because if you have a tool like Rikai-kun, if I turn it on, like I just turned it on, you can look at words and sound them out in hiragana. Kino, yesterday. Sukiyaki, thin slices of beast, beef. Taberu, to eat. You can of course see a change because it's conjugated. Tabemashita is the past form, so I ate. Sukiyaki. And if you have a tool like this, Hashiru, to run. If you know hiragana, you can read all this stuff. So it's a really good step to learn hiragana because then if you use a tool like this, you can read pretty much anything online. Very useful. Ie, house. And if you look up anything here, or if you're on anything in Japanese, you can look that up. So it's called Rikai-kun. what does the scouter say about his power level? And there's other software too. Yatta. Yeah, it's a very good tool. I recommend checking it out. Rikai-kun, it's free for Google Chrome. If you use a different operating system, I know there's one for Firefox too. It might be called something different. Um, I think that's called Rikai-chan, maybe. It's a very good tool. Yeah, just keep reading online for years, and then eventually... You'll be good to go. Alright, so what do we need here? Eh. I see what's going on. So we need to roll that ball into that door, it looks like. So this ne, Okamijin. Well put. Totemo benli. Very convenient tool. Kanari benli na dogu desu ne. Hmm. 
タイムアップを使います。Let's use a torch. We learned this word for torch the other day. タイムアップ、torch. We could shoot that down, but I don't want to waste an arrow on it. Yep, that. Well, this says, I watch dubbed anime with Japanese subs, or that's my ultimate goal. Yeah, that's a really good way to study. Highly recommended. I haven't done much of it.、It's I'd like to do more. Kishi no Ken. The knight sword. Kishi means sword, and then Ken means knight. This one's almost broken. Let's use this up. Not sure how good that apple would be being in this shrine for like hundreds of years, but okay. w e s h s o d a s n a h Yeah, you can find a lot of Japanese subs. Whoa. I didn't know I'd have to fight again. We should probably heal. At least a little bit. しましたね、okay, what do we have now?、Uh, okay. なるほど。カノアカノ。こんにちは。Good to see you, カノカオ。カノアカノ、How are you? 今日は、今日も元気ですか ?How are you doing today? We got another barrel. I don't know, do we use those for something or do we just kind of blow it up? I don't really know. Yeah. Hmm, not sure if I want to fall down there or not. Ooh, what do we have here? Something strange. This is a large place. This is like Ninja Warrior or something. Sasuke no yona tokoro. Hiroi. Kodai no koa. Got an ancient core. Genki. So this ne. Omoshiro so na. Hokra this ne. Choto. Musigashi. Gamboro. Shira bere. Eh? Nani kore? Eh? <laughs> Omoshiro desu ne. Naru horo. So you koto ka. Not what I was expecting, but. Okay. Saigo d e s t a Par three. <laughs> Arigato. What? It's not over yet. Mara Mara. What now? Hmm. Okay. ありがとう頑張ります。Alright, what now? 
problem is it seems like it will fall. We want that ball to get over here somehow. Ah, okay. We need to make it jump, it looks like. Nah. It looks like it's pretty far to jump. Is that really going to work? Let's try it. Yatemiru. To try something, you can say, like, I'll try it. Yatemiru. Yaru to do, and then miru to try something when you add it to another verb. Yatte miru, let's give it a try. Wrong button. よっしゃ。できました。多分。まだですか。え、I cannot believe it's not done yet. This is like the longest shrine ever. この奥だ。できるかな。よし。もう少し。ウルサマ、ようこそ。Japanese Japanese Quest. This is a channel where we learn Japanese from Japanese games. I'm a Japanese teacher in the US, so, and I also like games, so I thought it'd be cool to try to combine the two. So the goal is always to try to focus on both. To find language in games and to level up doing that. It helps when you're learning a language to have a concrete goal and have a concrete way to measure progress with that goal. For example, you want to learn so many words, you want to pass this test, having a, a clear goal. One of the goals we have on this quest is to uh, gather words that we find on our journey through all the games, through all the streams, and eventually to keep working toward our goal of over 9,000, or near fluency. In Japanese, it's often said, you need about 10,000 words to approach fluency in a language. Right now we're at 575, but that power level is going up. Urusama says, Arigato, I love this idea and just started learning recently. Nice. Very cool. How are you learning? Are you in a class? We always like to hear how people have different ways to learn. There are many ways to learn Japanese. It's cool to hear different methods. And Kano Kano Arigato. Thanks for the compliment. Whoa, what? Okay. That's the end. How do we get the treasure, though? Takara. Hoshine. Demo doyate. How do we get it? What did I even hit to make this go up? I don't even know. Oh, here we go. 
Nani? Anyone know how to get this treasure from the backside, maybe? Naruhodo. Yatta. Yatta. Hajimete no Daimondo. It's our first diamond in this game. Very nice. Diamondo. You can see it in katakana there. Hairaru de toreru naka de wa motto mo kichou na koseki. So the most precious mineral of all the minerals in Hyrule. Utsukushi kageyaki wa korai yori hitobito no kokoro torai. So from long ago, its sparkle has caught the imagination of people, the hearts of people. Taihen na takane de so yeah, it's sold for a lot of money. We can get some good money for this thing. Um, so Uda-sama says, I'm studying on my own for now. Nice. Finding lots of websites and apps for it. Very cool. Yeah, there's so much on the internet now. You really can teach yourself a language much more easily than you could even like 10, 20 years ago. Shira bit it, let's investigate. Yeah, what this site is trying what Japanese Quest is kind of trying to be, there's so much on the internet already. And I was kind of thinking as a Japanese teacher, like what could be my thing to add to that, something that doesn't currently exist. And I realized there's not much in the area of learning Japanese from video games. Like a lot, some people have tried it, but most don't continue doing it. I thought I'll be playing games in Japanese anyway, so I might as well teach Japanese through games. Now, what's a good way to do that? And I thought, what if you leveled up as you play the game? So that's what we're trying to do: is as we play the games, we level up in the game. We also level up in the language as we progress with words, but also with grammar as well. We often have a grammar target. And we also have a sentence deck now, so we're looking for sentences too in game that we can add to our deck. Or add to our a chronicle of our journey, sentences. So Uru Samas, um, my friend gave me a site that provides all sorts of subtitles for anime from English to hiragana to kanji to romaji. Nice, yeah. I've seen sites like that too. I haven't used them so much, but that could be a great way to study. Yeah, I recommend whatever you're into, if you find a way to study through that in a way that you can feel progress, you feel it's worthwhile. Whatever way makes you feel motivated as you study makes you keep studying every day. That's the important thing, I feel like, finding a way to study every day. I recommend finding a variety of ways to study. For me, the most useful were Anki, a flashcard system, just reading online with a reading tool like Rikai-kun. Uh, like watching and listening to things for listening practice. Um, and then once I got to high enough level, just reading a lot in Japanese and speaking as much as you can to Japanese people, obviously, as well. Um, Udusama says, for me, I switch it up a lot. I get bored of it. Don't. Yeah, I'm kind of the same. So I like switching it up. And I think it's good to switch it up, have many sources of Japanese. I always tell people, this stream, if you're serious about Japanese, should not be your only source of Japanese. I kind of see this as a fun way to get some exposure to Japanese. But I recommend finding many different sources. If you're serious, starting out off in a textbook can be really helpful. Like the Genki textbook is usually the one that's most popular now and thought to be quite good. It's also the one I use in college, the Genki series of textbooks. All right, one thing I was thinking today that we could stand to do, if we can find it, is uh, to look for some of these memories. We only found two memories so far. You can see that by the film strip. And each of these memories gives a nice video. For example, let's find, let's look at one of the ones that we watched 
just for fun. I won't translate it, but just see how much you can read of it. And I want to get a sense of this memory just so we can look for some more today. Yimashou. Ah, uh, we can't watch it from here. That's okay. We don't have to watch it right now. Anyway, let's try to find some more of these. This one... Okay, I think I know where this one might be. In front of the castle. Let's look for this memory. Kyoku wo sagashite miru. Kyoku means memory. Sagasu, to look for. Kono kyoku wo sagashite miru. Let's take a look. Let's look for that memory. It might be dangerous though, because the guardians are everywhere over there. So I'm thinking starting at this tower. Well, this looks pretty close to where that probably is, but let's try the tower. Gamboro. Yeah, if anyone else in chat wants to mention how they study Japanese and like which different ways they use, because often there's many different ways to study, right? Uh, it's always helpful to hear different perspectives. I changed things a lot as I was studying Japanese over the years. Like before Anki existed, I used a different soft card program. I think it was called something like Kantango or something like that. It was for flashcards. It did not have this SRS, spaced repetition aspect to it. Also, the remembering the kanji and the website with it, called Kanji Kohi, was very helpful, I thought, as well, if you want to learn kanji. I like the website, Kanji Kohi, better than the book for remembering the kanji. All right, so... Hmm. So this is the front of the castle, and it looked like there was some ruins somewhere. In front of it. I think it'd be somewhere around here. I thought I could see it from here, but me and I. The art of memorizing. Okamijin says. My chat on my other screen for some reason is not working, refreshing it. Anyway, let's see. Uh, I know there's a lot of guardians down here, but... Sa, itte mi See what I mean? Abunai desu ne. Daijobu kana. Anytime you're going toward the castle, it's dangerous. Probably a guardian over this hill. Okay, yeah, I think this area may be where that memory is. I'll mark it. Bite. A lot of apples here. Algade has a long comment about what you've done for studying. Nice. I'll read it as I look for some apples here. I went through Kanji damage with Anki right after learning Kana. Nice. During that time, I read through Tae Kim's grammar guide. Yeah, that's a great 
guide as well. After that, I started the 10K word list on the lenshu.org and reading through dictionaries and Japanese for grammar. Now I'm mining vocab for manga, anime, podcast, Twitch. Nice. Sounds good. Yeah, it sounds like your paragraph there is, I think, similar to a lot of people's paragraph in the sense that they kind of find what works best for them and they kind of make their own plan in a way. That's what I did. Just find something. Okay, this thing is useful. Try it for a week. Okay, this is working. Keep it up for months. Drop something if it doesn't seem useful. Repeat. So it's good to hear lots of different perspectives, because everyone, I think, learns a bit differently. There are some proven methods that people have been successful with, but that doesn't necessarily mean everyone will be successful or enjoy those methods. Interesting. What kind of nut is this? Kotori no ki no mi. Like a small bird tree nut? Not sure what kind of nut this is. Ego de nan desu ka? Not sure what that is in English. Kotori ga konomu chisai na ki no mi. Yeah, but it says like a small bird. That's who likes this nut, eh? Interesting. So if you eat it now, hardly any effect, but if you use it for cooking, it can be used as a spice. Spice to toshite. So toshite, it's a piece of grammar that allows you to say as something, so as a spice, it can be used. Spice to toshite, sukawaru. Iidesne. I wonder what it was in English, because it was definitely not small bird nut, I don't think. Interesting. Also looking up a lot of things on Google. Yeah, Google helps so much. But to me, my probably biggest two tools that I just used every day were every day for years, just building and building vocabulary and, and reading prowess was Anki and Rikaikun. Just any on any online reading tool. I don't know why my mouse is making these weird marks. For me these two tools used together kind of create like a a nice feedback loop. That every day I do flashcards, learn new words. Every day I would read more using Read Kaikun. And reading flashcards, reading words, reading words, reading words. And eventually, if you get to a point where you know around 10,000 words through reading and flashcards, then you can start, even before really, but then you can start to read books. Which I use my Kindle for. So that's what I found to be very useful. Just keep up that cycle for a couple years, a few years, along the way adding other sources and resources as you find necessary. And that's often what I did. So let's see the comments there. Uh, Okamijin. So Welda says, Kyokujutsu is read Kyokujutsu, right? Yes, that's right. <laughs> Yeah, Anki plus Rikaikun. Yeah, that's what I found to be useful. But again, everyone's different. Everyone finds different resources to be useful. Kyokujutsu, mnemonic device, or like a memory device. So this ne. All right, so let's see here. Koi. Yeah, 
Yep, you gotta weld this. Well done. You're coming a long way. Please don't rain. I just want to climb this pole in peace. Whoa, what? Why? Not that. <laughs> oh well. Ah, oh, Kitsune. We got a fox. Ah, oh, Blood Moon, boy. That might mean some of these guardians will come back because we killed some before. I saw a guardian, so let's kind of hide here. Ah, check it out. See the memory. Arimasune. Ooh, but the Guardian's right there. Koi. Kyoku. Arimasu. So if this memory's long, I think I'll just let it run. Okay, we're getting attacked. This is not good. Just let us look at our memories. I, th I think we won't get out of this one without fighting. So let's prepare ourselves. Seems like he wants to throw down. Maybe not. Quite. Whoa, what? Another one! Koayo, kore. Nice timing on the Blood Moon, right as we're gonna get killed by these guys. No, Zelda, don't just tell us, save us! Please save us. So she's saying, be careful. Great timing. We're gonna die. Shinu. Omae wa mo shindeiru. On his side, that's not good. Now we can get away. Eh, fighting this guy in the water is stranger than I expected. There we go. Oh no, we got company. I don't think we can be two at once. I think that could be a problem. See how this goes. Okay. We are dead. Pabu. That was interesting. Okay, now. Um. Hmm. This is quite a sticky situation. Perhaps if we have stamina, we may be able to kill this one, which would be nice. I don't know, let's just try our best. That works strangely well. You can hide behind one guardian while the other one the other one can't see you. Yatta. Ja, matane. Katta. Get 
think we got that new fancy sword. Worked quite well. Moikai, you have to meet it. Let's try it again. See if we can get a memory without getting attacked this time. Oh, Moi does it to remember. ハイラルの勇者よ。その対馬の努力と結実世紀研究を認め、女神ハイリアの名において祝福を授けん。空を舞い、時を巡り、黄昏に染まろうとも、結ばれし剣は勇者の魂とともに、さらなる力が。そしてタイマの剣に宿らんことを。遥か遠き過去に生まれし、やれやれ。剣よ。前途多難未定だな。ハイラルの修行。何言ってんの。お月の騎士任命の記念に太古の伝説真似てみろって生やし立てたの。とはいえ彼に対する態度に関してはあの姫と気が合いそうだよ僕しょうがないよお姫様にとっちゃあいつの存在はそうコンプレックスの象徴みたいなもんだから<音声><音声> Naruto. It's so small, I hope you can see it well, it says. Uh, yeah, I see it. It's interesting how you say you have that same symbol in Arabic. It does a similar thing as a small suit in Japanese. And my name is Fish the Third. Welcome back. And we're getting attacked again. We will look at that scene that we just saw in a second, but let's see if we have to deal with this guy right now. Seems like he might want to battle us. Konnichiwa! Genki! <laughs> ah! Megid Warrior! Yokoto! Japanese Festival, good timing. You are here just in time for us to uh, fight our friend here. Not letting us see our memories in peace. I am Akira Sensei. I'm a Japanese teacher. I specialize in teaching Japanese grammar and destroying guardians. So let's try to do a bit of both of those things today. Gambaro! I think we almost got this guy. Uh, a little bit more. Most go she. Got that. Katsumashitane. So Megid, Megid Warrior again. Welcome. Yokozo. Japanese quest away. We now have. A Megad 
warrior in our party. Sounds like a good thing. Anyone who follows joins us on this journey through Japanese games and into the Japanese language. We're all on a quest together. Wow, we beat three guardians today. We've come a long way on this journey. Use deflection, two hits to finish him off. Yeah, I don't do that. Not my style. I don't fight defensively. I jump in. Swinging. I'm into deflecting. I don't really use my shield. Don't really want to. But thanks for the suggestion. If you are a streamer who streams Japanese games and you deflect with your shield, I will definitely uh, host your channel sometime, though. I like to host other Japanese gamers, people playing Japanese games, learning from Japanese games, or who are Japanese. Melee mode, Barbarian Link activated. <laughs> so desu ne. There's gotta be some fairies around here. Our quest would not be complete if we don't cut some grass in a Zelda game. That's what it's all about. Toru. Ganbari Batta. Alright, let's look at that scene that we just saw. And let's break it down. Break down some of the language we see there. You saw that memory right here. In this place, you can see we have the Triforce, so they had a ceremony here. When we find a sentence in game, we draw the Triforce. So let's try to find some sentences, let's try to find some words to make our power level go up on this journey here. Let's take a look at the scene. I will bring it up quickly by going into our VOD, into our videos. Anyone can check out the VODs on Twitch or YouTube. Let's make sure it's refreshed to current. Let me find that there. Pause it and I'll bring it to the VOD view. Konnichiwa. Genki. Okay, so where were we? Through Japanese games and... In I'm hoping it's going to load. So it looks like the memory just ended. That. Okay, here we go. So the one who is chosen by the Master Sword. Uh, I see a couple of questions in the chat, so let's look at that. Um, Okamijin says, Kinsetsu can be translated as melee or close quarters. Uh, yeah, can it? I'm not sure about that. Kinsetsu, I just know it as, I know it as meaning like adjacent or neighboring. Um, so this ne, yeah, kano kano. That's what I was saying. Kusa o karu no ga tanoshi desu ne. Cutting grass is fun. If anyone wants to know what kano kano said there, is cutting grass. Kusa is grass, and then karu to cut grass. So the champion of Hyrule. So now all of your efforts that are, have been unceasing and your sword ability as well are being acknowledged. So in the name of the goddess Hylia, we will bestow on you this blessing. Alright. Sodo o mai, so flying through the sky, like going through time. I think this is referencing the different games of Zelda. What do you think? Like. Skyward Sword, maybe, and then Ocarina of Time, and then what's the next one? 
Um, yeah, Twilight. Yeah, that's the Twilight Princess. Like, being dyed in the color of Twilight is kind of what it said. This... Yeah, this sword along with your soul, the soul of the champion. So even more power will be given and be sto like so stored inside this master sword. Yare, yare. Zento tanamite da na. Zento tanamite da na. Zento taran. So that's one of those uh four kanji. Um, yo yoji jukugo four kanji compounds, and I think I do know what it means, but I want to check it to be sure. Um, zento. Zento. Tanan. So there may be some nuances that I might miss. So yeah, having many difficult difficulties in store. Grim prospects. So Zento, the reason why I wasn't totally sure on the four compound together because I haven't seen it that much, but when you break down the kanji, it's pretty clear. So Zento means like the future, the journey ahead. And then Tanan means lots of difficulties. So when you put it together, the future looks like there'll be lots of difficulties. Zento Tanan. These are fun to learn. There's many of these four kanji compounds that you can learn in Japanese. You can find websites devoted just to them. So what are you talking about? Yeah, so like... He's saying, what are you complaining about? You're the one who said she should do this, you know, this ancient um, commemoration of uh, the fate of the warrior and their, you know, ancient tradition. You're the one who wanted to see all this. So it seems like he gets along well with the princess. Taido ni kanshite. So Taido is attitude, and ni kanshite means like regarding her attitude. Kare ni taisuru means towards him, and then Taido ni kanshite means regarding her attitude. Anohime to ki ga aiso. So they seem to get along well. Ki ga ao. Yeah, thanks for writing that down, Okamichin. Yoji Jukugo. Four character idiomatic compounds is what the dictionary is defining it as. Oh. She says that's to be expected, I mean, to the princess. Complex no shocho. So he's a symbol of like a complex that she has about these traditions I think they're talking about. Shocho means symbol, like something symbolic. Naruhoro. Kanashime. She's got a bit of the sad eye, just like Shin had in Xenoblade 2. Kanashime desu ne. Yoshi, dekimashita. Let's bring it back to the game. Every time I click in here, I see we have news. I kind of want to check some of that news once in a while. I've never really done it on a stream. It's probably silly to do so. But one cool thing is if you follow... If you have a Japanese Switch account, you get all this news in Japanese too, and it can be good reading practice. Reading about these different games and reading about news and the bestsellers. 
For example, this one, Fantasy Star Online 2 just came out, and if you look at the, what it says there, let's break down a little bit what it says. So, Kihon Pure Muryo. So reading things like this, even just simple titles can be useful. Muryo means free, so you can play Fantasy Star Online 2 for free. The basic play is free on that game, which is kind of cool. I actually used to play this on my computer a few years ago to study Japanese. I haven't played that game recently, but... And yeah, and also it says, Kokunai Saidai Kyu no Online RPG. So nationally in Japan, it's their biggest online RPG is what that means. And of course, I've got an English account too, so you get the English and you can compare them. And you can notice how the translation is different. Like in English, it just says new hint art is here. Whereas Japanese, they say all kinds of stuff. Kombu ga ippai. So here they say kombu ga ippai, which means like kombu is like, you know, this like kelp stuff. So there's lots of kelp. Super Mario Odyssey, you know, atarashi. Otakara shashin, so taking pictures of like treasure pictures, otoroke. So like new, completely new, completely different translation. It's interesting to see some of that sometimes to compare. What else do we have these days? What's the new news in Switch world? Narohoro. Takaramono. Yeah, you see this word so much, right? In this game too, takaramono, treasure. And so in order to get your treasure back, you gotta do something with your sword. Ken. <laughs> ah, shiro ni shinyu. Yeah, you have to go into this castle. So a lot of stuff with castles, a lot of stuff with swords. Ken, shiro, put them together. Ken, shiro, omae wa mo shindeiru. Alright, let's go back to the game. Okami Jin says, Fantasy Star Online 2 ga Hotondo Rokusai desu. Ah, Narodo. Kanari. Furu desu ne. It's pretty old now, huh? Hmm. Kudi sensei, you're holding the nickel. Do you want to play for a little bit? I was about to take a break for a second. Want to? So Kudi Sensei has been studying for N2 and also writing a novel this month because it's National Novel Writing Month. So if you want to talk about writing novels or or uh, studying for N2, you can talk to her for a few minutes. I'm going to take a break for just a second. I'll be right back. Uh, and what we just did, we just saw our memory here. And now we're just kind of wandering around looking for other memories, kind of exploring. And so really, whatever is fine. All right. So I'll be right back. Itadakimasu. Let me see if I can remember even how to get to the memories in this game. Let's see. And that's right. It's in. Well, since I can't remember how to get to these two memories, I'm just do some wandering until it gets to the comes back. Hopefully, I won't get killed by a guardian. Because if I encounter one, I'm probably definitely going to die. Very dangerous. Let's see. Maybe. Could 
can go here. Actually, not totally sure where we warp to. Oh, looks like we're on the plateau. All right. Let's see what's going on in these parts. So I didn't remember how to get to the list of memories. Okay. So I just warped to a random place and wandered around. Okay. Um, yeah, I know there is some memory somewhere near here, right? Yeah, I know that there's one over here. Kyokuga arimasne. So that's kind of, I tried to get to a warp spot that was relatively close. Right. But I don't really remember exactly where it is, so I don't know. Alright. Want me to play again? Or do you want to play a bit more? I want to see if it's playing. Okay. Go for it. Chris, uh, Kuri sensei is quite good at uh, finding memories. <laughs> so, probably there is one over here somewhere. <laughs> she knows a lot more about Zelda than I do. I'll just draw on the screen for now. So we just had a new follower recently, so we have a new party member. Megod Warrior, they can run with us as well. So Megod Warrior, they're also looking around, looking for this memory. I'm not exactly sure where they are. You can look at the picture. Did you look at the picture? I don't know how to look at the picture. Uh, That's what I meant when I said that you don't know how to look at You just need to go to your map. Just go to the map and then press R for the album. Adobomu. Oh, okay. That's it. This is the one I was thinking. Yep. Okay, so that was nice. So this hill. Okaga. I must know. And then Ursama, Ur, Ur, Urusama, joined us as well. So we have another party member, Urusama. Urusama can join us here. Atarashi Nakama desne. Ishoni boken shio. Buru Sama has this nice hat as well. Mega Warrior sounds like more of like a warrior, so they should have like some kind of helmet. Ah, Ah, arimasne. Hi. Okay, so it looks like we found a new memory, so I will take over now. Arigato. Sasuga Kuri Sensei. Okay, so let's take a look at another, another memory. Then we can break it down once we watch it with the Japanese. And let's remember, let's focus on a couple things. Our power level today will go up at least to 580, let's try. So any words that we find in this memory, those can also go into our memory, into our brain on this quest. Right here, this is five words going into our brain. That's kind of how it looks. 
graphically. So let's try to do that. Also, you don't have a sentence yet today, so let's look for a sentence too. Let's find a nice, juicy sentence to add to our sentence chronicles. <laughs> Nani? Huh? So let's remember. Hora. これから薬剤I really like how this game is set up with these memories and it can go in whatever order you find them. It's a cool way to set up a Zelda game considering there's usually not much story, but it's a good way to do it. Um, can you hear the voice? Fee's voice. <laughs> is that what they're referring to? Who's, who is Fee? In the comments there. Do you know what that means, Kuri Sensei? Fee's voice? You mean I don't know, I couldn't hear. I well, I know, but who is Fee? Fee is the one inside the sword. Oh, okay. Ah, you'll say we got a fairy. Nice. From Skyward Sword. Oh, uh, yeah. Naruto. I thought Kuri Sensei would know that. Um, I did not know about Skyward Sword personally. You'll say. Wow, they got a lot of fairies around here. I wish that in real life, when you're just mowing lawns, like you're mowing your lawn, you get fairies. And when you get the fairies, like if you get hit by a car later that week, then you can just come back to life. That's what I wish the real world was like, not just this game. Because, like, it would make mowing your lawn so much more interesting if you could find, like, fairies when you mow over a certain part. And rice. Yeah, and, like, lizards and stuff. That'd be so tight. Yeah, crickets. But especially fairies. Yeah. Then you could just like fall off a cliff later in the day, and then you just get revived. Uh, anyway, let's have a look at that me that memory that we just saw. Let's go back to our VOD. I will refresh it and find that scene. Let's go to our VOD view. So this hill. Juicy sentence to add to our sentence. Good timing. So Okamijin says, truck Kun already has enough victims. <laughs> so does Ne. Huh? Ah. And so yeah, let's try to find a sentence. Let's try to find some words so we can add to our power level. So let's remember. It seemed like a pretty good memory. I think we can find both of those things. Let's look for words and let's look for a sentence or two. Gambaro. ほら。思い出した。
Kore kara. So from now, we are heading for Goron City. Goron City ni mukaimasu, much like we did earlier. Mm -hmm. uh, well, this says, imagine if they add a lawnmower in Zelda Breath of the Wild. Ooh, that would actually be, that would not be bad. That'd be pretty cool. In the DLC contents. It, DLC. it, it, it could be like, a, like an ancient Sheikah technology lawnmower. Yeah. That, that'd be not bad. Powered by the Sheikah Slate. Yeah, exactly. Like, tower. it could be a new Sheikah Slate ability. <laughs> uh, let's see. So, what is she saying here? I got distracted by lawnmowers. Alright, so yeah. So, Darukeru, the hero, that's the champion of the, mm. the, uh, the Goron. And she's talking about in increasing his affinity with the beast. Shinju to no aisho takamaru. So we need to make some adjustments to increase his affinity with the beast, the divine beast. So even though we he's moved it a lot already, mada mada michinobu bubun. So there's still a lot we don't know. Um, well, this says yeah, and make Ganon totally bald. Sorry for interrupting the lesson with silly comments. No, silly silly comments are good. Like, you have to imagine we're all on this journey. Uh, imagine that we're all in there. We're all, you know, in the grass. We're not just going to all be quiet. There's going to be silly comments. There'll be questions about Japanese. There'll be, you know, mentioning words, whatever. It's like the Lord of the Rings, and there's little silly parts. Right. It's like Lord of the Rings. There's funny parts. There's, you know, parts you learn something. There's parts that it's dramatic. You know, a journey is really about all of that. There's trolls in Lord of the Rings as well. There's occasional trolls on Twitch. <laughs> uh, so, それでも yeah, あれは人の手で作られたもの So let's break this one down a little bit. Um, so that divine beast, all these divine beasts, were made by human hands. So hito means person, te means hand. 人の手で作られたもの so these are all things made by humans. Let's think about words too. We have this word hito, person. I think we have the word te as well. And sukuru, I think we also have to build. So let's keep looking. All right, so if it is man-made, jinko no mono nara. Jinko, we have that word too. Jinko no mono nara. So if it is man-made, kitto, so surely, so we can surely understand it. So the same rikai means to understand. Also, what I, I mentioned that program before that I recommend, rikai-kun. Um, that's why it's called rikai-kun, because it's a helper for you understanding websites. So rikai means to understand. Tsukai-yo um, mo wakarimasu. So yeah, if it's man-made, we can definitely understand it. And we can understand how to use it. Uh, this is a pretty nice sentence. So I'm not totally sure there's anyone in the chat right now who's able to write this. But if you can, uh, why don't we try to mark this as a, for a sentence deck? We don't have a sentence yet today. So we could try to write this in chat. So let's see if we can write this in chat down here. And I will break it down. And if there's words, we can add some of those to our our uh, power level as well. So jinko no mono nara. So let's start here. So jinko no mono. So it's a man-made thing. Jinko means man-made, and mono means thing. Jinko no mono nara. So if it is man-made, kitto, which means definitely kitto, rikai dekimasu. So if it's man-made, we can definitely understand it. Rikai dekimasu shi. And tsukaiyo mo wakarimasu. So we can also understand how to use it. Tsukao means to use. Tsukaiyo means like how to use it. Tsukaiyo mo wakarimasu. So her whole point that Zelda is making here is that if it's man-made, if it's made by people, we can definitely understand it, and we can understand how to use it. And the way she says two, two different ways to understand. 
理解できる、to be able to understand, and then わかります、to understand. あ、ガレイさん、ありがとう。So I see the sentence there. Let's take a look.、Uh, 人口のものならきっと理解できますし、使いようもわかります。Looks correct, so let's see if we can hear what's going to happen. やった !We have unlocked the powers of that sentence. You can see that with the Triforce, and let's add that to our, to our sentences. I'll copy and paste that. And anyone can check out our list of sentences. It is linked on the Twitch page under the Language Arts section. And let's get the time as well. Ima, nanji desu ka? Ima, kuji, nijui pun. So it's now 9 21. So let's write that as well. So we got to send this. What do you think? Are there any words there that we can add to our words as well? We can power up with them.、Um, so, right now, I'm going to circle all the words that I think we already have added to our power level. And so, Jinko, we have, and I'll circle them red if we don't have it. Mono, thing, we have.、Um, Rikai, I'm not sure. Tsukao, to use, we have. Wakaru, to understand, we have. So we really have a lot of words if you think about it.、Um, dekiru means to be able to do. I think we have dekiru, but why don't we check a little bit on our、uh, power level deck so we can power up. Any other words you've seen today, feel free to suggest those in the chat now. Some words we can add.、Um, what does the she do again? I missed it.、Uh, Rikai dekimasu shi.、Um, yeah, it's kind of giving. Reasons like different things you can do with it, so you can understand it, you can also understand how to use it.、Uh, so it's kind of like listing different reasons or different ways that you can understand it because it's made by people. All right, let's go to our power level up screen. So you missed the she. Rikai dekimashi. Oh, I see the she there, though, Maybe your, in your sentence.、Uh, explanation. Maybe I missed your explanation. Ah,、uh, yeah, yeah. I, yeah. I didn't really explain it too much in my explanation, did I? Rikai dekimashi.、Um, Okamijin. She at the end of a、oh. phrase notes one of several reasons. Arigato, Okamijin. Thanks for writing that. It always helps to get input from chat as well. It helps have it written down and spoken as well. Yeah. The explanation. Yeah, I don't think I fully understood that. So, thank, I don't think I fully explained it. So, thanks for answering about that.、Uh, let's see here. So, let's look at our sentence, our word deck. So, these are the words that we've learned so far that we've added to our power level. And let's see a couple of those things that we just saw. Let's see if we have them yet. Let's change to Japanese. Dekiru, to do. So, we don't have dekiru even. Interesting. We probably should have Dekiru,、yeah. I think. So let's add Dekiru. It was used in the sentence we just saw in Rikai Dekiru. Let's see if we have Rikai actually. Rikai to understand. We just talked about Rikai Kun today. Rikai. So Rikai we do have. Interesting. I thought we might have it. So, Rikai, we have down there, understanding. Rikai, understanding. So, we do have that, but we don't have Dekiru. So, let's add Dekiru to our power level. Let's make that power level go up. Scroll down. Look at all the words we have so far. We're getting there to 9,000. Dekiru, to be able, to be able to do. All right, let's look back at that sentence again.、Uh, so, looking at the words, Jinko. Artificial, man made, we have that, so I'm using the Rikai Kun tool now. And then,、uh, Kitto. Yeah, that is a fairly common word. You're right, got it.、Um, kitto. Rikai dekiru. It's also a word you see often in things like games and anime. Kitto. Surely. Undoubtedly. Yeah, why don't we add that too? Let's copy it right out of, this, out of the sentence. Oh, that's bad. Let's. Can I undo that? It seems like copy and pasting out of this doesn't work. But let's look up kito in the dictionary. Kito. Dekiru koto ga dekiru. 
<laughs> いいですね。So, きっと、surely. It's usually not with a kanji. I think I won't even use the kanji when I put it on the, our card. But let's add きっと、which means surely. できることができる。Yeah. Kuri sensei says, できることがきっとできる Let's just keep layering the stuff on there <laughs> until it becomes totally unintelligible. It's just totally nonsense. So we have きっと Any other words? So, rikai, we learned.、Um, dekimasu. So, rikai, dekimasu means to be able to understand. Rikai dekimasu shi, tsukai yo mo wakarimasu. To understand. So, yeah, it looks like we drew the two words that we didn't have yet. Mono nara. So, interesting. Mono nara has its own word too. So, if I could. So, jinko no mono nara. So, if it is man made, then all of this. Then we can understand it. Then we can understand how to use it. Yatta. So, you'll come out Let's continue our memory then. So, I think we didn't finish. Ah, Stash House, hosto, arigato. Thanks for the host, Stash House. And welcome. We're just looking at a new sentence. We are just for the first time with this game, Breath of the Wild, learning from sentences as well. I think we'll keep this with Japanese Quest. Look at all these tasty words we found in this sentence Jinko, artificial, man made.、Uh, kito, surely, definitely. Likai, understanding. Dekiru, to be able. Tsukao, to use. Wakaru, to understand. See, when you have a sentence, you get so many words, you get so much grammar packed into it that that's really a good level to learn at the sentence level. <laughs> Welcome, Stash House. So let's go back to our game screen. What does the scouter say about his power level? Hosto, arigato. Thanks for the host. We'll continue looking at the memory we just saw. And our power level, oh, I, I should have made it go, go up, right, Nappa? So let's make that power level go up to 577. Sioku n a t a n e Let's find some more words and make that go up more as we look at more of this memory here. Dakara. So, watashi wa kanarazu. So I must. Kanarazu means must. Are o yakusai ga no ni. So, are meaning that divine beast, so these giant machines. I must use it against Ganon. Taiko dekiru yo. So, again, we see dekiru. And this time it's not, it's not to understand. This time it's to fight against Ganon. So, I've got to use that to fight against Ganon. Shiagete misemasu. By the way, Stash House, thanks for joining us.、Um, have you been playing Japanese games recently in your stream? If so, gotta send some more people over there. <laughs> I know you've been studying a lot of Japanese with、uh, remembering the kanji recently in Anki, I believe. We were just talking about study methods earlier, so if you want to chime in with how you're studying, because you're just starting, that would be really helpful maybe to some other people that are starting. So, can you, can you learn to use that sword on your back? Senaka means back. Sudugi means sword. Then, Tsukai Konaseru means to master it. So, have you mastered using that master sword yet? Senaka, back. So, that's a word. Have we learned that word yet?、Uh, I'm going to quick search Senaka, back. Have we learned Senaka? We have not learned Senaka. What do you think? Should we learn Senaka back? It's a pretty common word. Senaka no Tsurugi. So the sword on your back. Have you mastered it yet? Let's go back to the power level screen. So Senaka back. We have not learned it. So let's go back to the dictionary. Senaka. Senaka. 
And then maybe it's Suduki too. It's another rating for sword that we've seen so much that it might be worth its own word. What do you think? Suduki for sword. In games, it's used so much. It's kind of like a cooler way to say sword than Ken. You see Ken as well. But might be cool to use Tsurugi. That's the one that Zelda just said. Seinaka no Tsurugi. Let's just type in sword and see what we see. Katana, sword or katana. Ken, sword. Buryoku, armed might. Tolken, sword. Yaiba, blade or sword. Taiken, wearing a sword. Interesting, didn't see Tsurugi here. Haku is to like wear a sword. So I see a lot of comments from Stash House. Uh, so let's read some of that as we look at these. So I haven't, I haven't, I'm currently trying to get through the rest of my Anki deck before I go into reading a lot more. Good call, sounds good to me. And I spend like four hours a day grinding kanji at the moment. Nice, more if I can manage it. You were fighting the good fight. Yeah, putting kanji investment in early can help a lot. So that seems like a good strategy. But I just learned kana as fast as I could, then started reading bits here and there to keep solidifying my character recognition. And then remembering the kanji anki deck, I'm at 2,200 cards and then core 2k until I can somewhat read without assistance. Nice. I think all that investment will help a lot when you start reading more. But like I was saying earlier, um, as you start getting in a place to read more, I highly recommend having a tool like Rikai-kun. I'm not sure if you have that tool, but if you have Rikai-kun, a tool like that, you can read Japanese websites. So for example, just looking at the dictionary here, you can just start reading every day. I recommend, so you're doing flashcards, that's awesome. But I recommend when you get comfortable enough with it, just start reading websites that you're into and you can start looking at words, like only hover over them if you need to, obviously. Like, ken o toru mono wa minna ken de horobiru. So all who take up the sword will perish by the sword. Even just like reading through example sentences in a dictionary can be very helpful. And then words you don't know, you can hover over, ken sword, toru, to take. So those who take up the sword will perish by the sword. And then just, it kind of becomes this cycle I was talking about earlier of a feedback loop between Anki and then reading with Rikai-kun. So you do Anki, you do more reading. You do reading, you do more Anki. And it becomes this really powerful feedback loop of just learning lots of vocabulary, but also with Rikai-kun, a, a reading tool like that, building up context as well, seeing how the words fit together, you know, with the particles, things like de. So ken de horobiru, so they'll perish by the sword, the day they're meaning by. And so I highly recommend getting into some kind of nice feedback loop like this. Anki, 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 Rikai-kun, reading, 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 more flashcards, more reading. Do that for a few years, boom, you can read books. That's it, helped me anyway. And then of course, adding more in, adding fun stuff, adding games, adding whatever you're into, anime, whatever else, maybe a textbook here and there can definitely help as well to put it into a structure. All right, so where were we? I was thinking about adding Tsurugi. Uh, Rikai Kun and Kanji Tomo are great tools. Yeah, I've heard Kanji Tomo helps a lot for reading games as well. I'm hoping to read books quicker um, than a few years. Yeah, for sure. Definitely doable. I mean, yeah, you can certainly look at books um, a lot earlier, but uh, books will... Yeah, books are a challenge to just dive into. Let's see here. Where are we now? Um, Tsurugi. Sword. Interesting. It just says Ken for sword. Tsurugi no Yama. Mountain covered in swords. 
Interesting, a mountain in a hell covered in swords, which are buried so their tips point upward. Have you ever heard of this? I've never heard of this. A mountain of swords. Interesting. Tsurugi o nuku, to draw a sword. Seinaka no tsurugi. I guess since we already learned Ken, maybe we shouldn't learn Sword here. I don't know. I kind of want to, but on the other hand, maybe not. We can leave that for now, I suppose. Any other words that we saw there? So we got to say knock up back. Let's go back to where we were. Vegeta, what does the scouter say about his power level? Power level is now 578, so we gotta change that. Tsyokunatane. Hi, let's take a look at our memory again. And also, the voice inside that sword. Are you able to hear that voice? Mm. Let's bring it back to the game. And let's get a little bit more grass. We were just talking in chat, the stash house. It'd be nice if they had a, a lawnmower in this game. That you could maybe operate using your Sheikah Slate. Ooh. You'll sit. Yatta. We're getting all the fairies in here. Are we maxed on fairies now? I think you only have four. We have three, okay. You'll say, fairy. They really should have a lawnmower. Check out that tower. Ikimashou. Let's go for that tower. We've not discovered it yet. And let's find some more words along the way. We want to get at least to 580 today for our power level. Hopefully we can find some more words to add. So Stash House, if you're still there, I'm curious. How are you finding remembering the kanji so far? It seems like you're you're pretty deep in already. Some people love it, some people don't love it so much. It sounds like you're going through it pretty fast. But we do not want this branch. Iranai. So this word here. Kino eda. Eda branch. Iranai. Stead it to throw away. So eda o suteru. Those are two words we could add. Eda. Branch and then suited it. Something we've done a lot on this journey. <laughs> yeah, why don't we add those? Let's go back to our power level screen. Let's look up some new words. E da. Branch. So let's power up with power of tree branch even if we're not going to power up with it in the game. And then suited it to throw away, T to dump, to abandon. Useful verb. Yosh, Up to 580. Getting close to 600. Any more words, feel free to suggest in the chat. We can add those too. 
What does the scouter say about his power level? Scouter says her power level is now 580. Stash House says, remember the kanji is great. There are plenty more kanji uh, than I can remember because of the order of the kanji. Yeah, for sure. To some it might not be preferable to have a lot of the easier simple kanji later, but I'm happy with it. I used another deck for a while and found myself having to brute force to remember a lot more kanji than I am currently. I'd recommend it for sure. I agree. I, I went through remembering the kanji as well. I already knew a, th a thousand kanji at the time I did it, but I wanted a way to organize all the kanji I already knew and learn all the rest. I found it to be very useful. So Okomijin here says, So you always read at least one article on NHK Easy News. Yeah, NHK Easy News is a great resource. I highly recommend that for reading. NHK Easy News. Yeah, feel free to put a, like, a link there. Okomijin is such a good site. It's also linked in the resources section at the bottom of the Twitch page. Um, Baldridge says, just joining. Is Remembering the Kanji an Anki deck or something? Uh, yeah, ask Stash House. He can explain it. I'll explain what I know as well because it is useful to know about. Also, people talk about it on the Discord, so check out our Discord. People can talk about it there. Um, yeah, NHK Easy News is great, as is Remembering the Kanji. Um, remember remembering the Kanji is... Originally what it was is a book. It's a book that a guy wrote. A guy who knew no Japanese, he went to Japan, and he thought the way people learned kanji was not effective. It was not very... I don't know. It was slow. And he did research on kanji, and he learned all the kanji in a month. He could write all the kanji in a month by developing his own system. He didn't know any Japanese. He didn't know what the words meant. But he developed... just some guy developed this system. While he was in Japan, he went back and told his professors, because he was studying in Japan at a university, and no one believed him that he learned all the kanji, like 2,000 plus kanji in a month, but he showed them he could write them all. And they said, no, that's impossible, there's no way you can do that. But I heard, like, I believe the president of the college was intrigued and asked him, like, why don't you write it up in a book? So he did. He wrote it, wrote it up in a book, he published it, and that's the system that was, I think, written something like 30 years ago. And it's been popular ever since. Some people don't like it, because you don't learn the readings of the kanji in the system. You just learn how to write them and what their meaning is. Uh, but then, in addition to that book, which you can buy on Amazon, by the way, there's also a website for it. The website is called Kanji Kohi, so a website community supports it. And people write their own stories there, and you can upvote stories for each kanji. Um, also, there's Anki flashcards for the order that he teaches them in. Basically, it's a story for each kanji, building them up in order based on their different pieces. So that's basically what it is. It's a kanji system, a system for learning how to write and read all the kanji, and know the meaning for all the kanji. Ah! Nago-chan, Shua-san! Konnichiwa! Gokigen wa ikaga desu ka? How are you guys doing? It's good to see you. Sorry I talked so much in English before saying something. Ooh, I think we're gonna be cold here. Samui desu ne. Konnichiwa. Yeah, it's a mnemonic device. So I'm good and you. Okage sama de. Genki desu. Yogatta. I am doing well. So let's go for that tower. Wait, is that the tower we're going to? Taboon. Yeah, that's the way we're going. I'm good in you. Yep, I'm good. I'm very good. It's more good this yo. Jin wa tanoshi kara. Game mo tabi mo nakama mo 
いろいろ楽しいですねはい。But it's very helpful for anyone studying Japanese, so I recommend following them. Stash House does some streams showing how they study Japanese and will stream more Japanese games, so I recommend following Stash House as well. Shirabaru, let's examine this thing. <laughs> ah, なるほど時代劇 So that's a, a Japanese play. Jinsei Raku Arya Kumu Aru. So, yeah, it means there's, there's good things in life, there's comfortable things in life, there's also difficult things in life. So, that's your name, Tashikani. その表現も好きですね。人生は楽しいから。ありがとうございます。<笑>素敵な言葉ですね。ありがとうございます。頑張ります。調べる。楽もあれば苦労もあります。そうですよね。という歌詞。そういや歌詞、meaning like lyrics. あ、こんにちは。ドールコーブ、こんにちは。元気ですか ?How are you doing, ドールコーブ ?Good to see you. What is going on in this place? え、たま。生徒、どうの選択。So you must choose like stillness and movement. Interesting. Alright. Ah, so it was Kashi this ne. Yeah, for anyone in chat, yeah, check out some of the song lyrics that Nago chan and Shua san are writing. Um, the word for song lyrics is. Kashi, and then the other word they're putting there is serufu, which means like line someone says. Yokata, Dodikov, good to hear you're doing well. Mito, Mito Komon. Kono Mondo Koro, so the family crest got. メニーいらぬ。なるほど。全然わからない。<笑> I'm not understanding those lines, but thank you for writing them. Perhaps I can read them later <笑> and understand it. これは何ですかこれ。ああ、I think we need to use a, like an arrow or something. 多分。そういうことか。やってみる。Let's give it a try. ひ
一つでいいかなやったできました That was close. Almost missed. <laughs> yep. Da. Take him, Ashton. So, yes,、yeah, similar kanji, but different meaning. Ah. Yeah, so you fall down seven times, you can get up eight times. So, this ne. Ooh, what do we have here? Koi. I think they want me to deflect here. Does your cat respond to Japanese or English? Ah,、uh, both. Griffin is fluent in both languages. So I think. Let's change our shields here. Let's see if I can block them with this. I think this can bounce them back, maybe? Yatta. Yosh. Where'd the other one go? Do not know. Eh, quite. He's tight. Nigiro. Ah, this kind of place, okay. This is where it gets interesting. Hmm. Okay, now for the hard part. Let's catch this, ne. Gambolimas. これはちょっとドキドキ私もドキドキしますドキドキしてますありがとうベストを尽くしますあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあっあ早くあー残念<笑>死んだ
すみませんでしたあーあー残念失敗したもう一回やってみる If anyone knows a better way please tell me あっ I'm sure I'm making mistakes 逃げろ早く There's probably a better way to do this. Don't really know what it is. Don't mind this. Gamble mas. Arigazaimas. Nana Korobi Yaoki. Fall down seven times. Get up eight times. タイミングはちょっと良くないですね間に合い間に合いませんやっぱり言うと言うと言うと言うと言うと言うと言うと言うと言うと言うと言うと言うと言うと言うと言うと言うと言うと言うと言うと言う This challenge right here is a metaphor for life. Fall down seven times, get up eight. Nana Korobi Yaoki. Toru! 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 Baka! Baka! Link wa baka! Sumimasen de shita. 失敗しました<笑>でも楽しいあれは何があったのかとても難しいとのことです。But I feel like if we create a log jam here, It should work with this current strategy. There's probably a better way to do this, but I don't know what it is. Gambodol. Maybe. Ikimasho. えー、なんでなんでだよ惜しい惜しい<笑>難しいですね。Let's eat some food. Don't wanna die. 死にたくない。Freeze the ball and launch it. Maybe, but I don't know if we can clear the thing then if we do do that. アキラ先生ならきっとできる。ありがとうございます。頑張ります。できますよ Not sure what happened last time. Maybe my timing for this strategy is not quite right. Oh, you did a similar thing? Okay, good to know. Good to hear. Or you, you shot it over there? Can you get over this thing without getting the ball? Eh? ダメダメですね。とても難しい。So you knocked it over? Can we get through the lasers like that? I suppose we could. Hmm. So if we track it exactly, even just one big block should be enough. You'd think. Let's just try with one big block and see how it goes. Uh. Hi, 
これを使いますタイミングはちょっと難しいけどやったできましたねカメラの角度は大切です。The, the angle of your camera helps a lot with that part. If you angle it this way, you can just track it and make sure you're tracking the barrier. やったできましたね Let's bring some hype into the chat. やったぜ人生は最高奥起きましたね。We came up from those seven falls. Although there's a treasure too, though, right? Takara mo arimasu ne. Takara wa. Arigozaimasu. Thank you for the comments. Is that a metal treasure over there? I'm not sure. やった。タカラゲット。オーパル。ハイラルで取れる鉱石の一つ。So one mineral you can get in high roll. Very nice. 行きましょう。あ、達成感あるよね。Let me teach you a new word. Taseikan. That's what you need for when you, when you accomplish something that's really hard, you get that feeling of accomplishment. In Japanese, Taseikan. Taseikan. Let me look it up in the dictionary over here. Tase, achievement. Tase do, level of achievement. Tase kano, achievable. Tase kan, this is what I'm saying here. Sense of accomplishment. So kan means like a feeling, a sensation. Tase kan, a sense of achievement. I really feel that after passing this. Tase kano, kanjiru. Tase kan ga aru. So desu ne. 喜びも、きっとしよう。Yeah, so feeling really happy about completing something. 苦しいことを乗り越えたとき、達成感がある。そうですね。So what that means, what Shua wrote there is, 苦しいこと means like difficult things or something that's painful. When you overcome it, the word for overcoming is 乗り越える、to climb over. To surmount, to、uh, overcome something. So when you overcome it, you feel. Taseikan. Taseikan ga aru. You have a feeling of accomplishment. So d e s u ne. Thanks for writing that as well, Shuo san. Kitto, i b e n k y o ni naru. Can definitely teach some people something that watch this video, if not now, maybe sometime later on YouTube. Vegeta, what does the scouter say about his power level? The scouter says her power level is 580. Sentoryoku wa gohyaku hachiju desu ne. Tsuyoku natta. Goku yori tsuyoku natta. At least the early Goku. Wakai yo Goku yori tsuyoku natta. Ne. Okay, so, now where do we go? Up. What is this? Strange. A little strange shape. It's kind of strange shape. 
Uh, let's see... What do we do? Ah! Arimasu. Onachi katachi ga hitsuyo desu ne, dakara... Koko ni. Eh? Awanai. So, yatte, so shite, yatta. Uwa, mitsukatta! You found me! Korogu no mi. So, we have another Korok seed. So something good will happen if we collect some of them. Mata ne. See you. Konochi kara wa benli desu ne. Kekko takai. Koro-chan, kawaii desu ne. Yeah, those Koroks are really cute in this game. They remind me of... I've mentioned this before on stream, but they mention me of... They remind me a lot of... Kodama. In... In, uh... Morenoke Hime no Kodama to nitemasu ne. Hai, hai. Ah! Konnichiwa. Kawaii. Tatakai takunai. Nitemasu ne. Yeah, they're very much like those. Kodama. And they're both forest spirits. Mori no. Mori no. Ma, yosei no yona. Sonza desu ne. Kodama to Korogu. Nitemasu ne. Mou skoshi. I ate ramen for lunch a while ago. Naruhoro. Ramen o tabemashita ka? Dono ramen o tabemashita? What kind of ramen did you have? Miso ramen to ka, tonkotsu ramen to ka. Watashi mo tabetai desu ne. Ramen ga daisuki desu. Nihon ni sunda toki ni yoku Ramen Stadium toyu tokoro de ramen no tabemashita. Hakata ramen, Fukuoka de yoku tabemashita ne. Fukuoka de yoku Kanaru City というショッピングモールに行きましたそこでよくラーメンの美味しいですねラーメンそうですねはい博多ラーメンは美味しいですよ Yeah 福岡 is known for their Honkotsu ramen, which is like. Whoa! Nani kore? Bikuri shita. Mizu to motta. Mizu de wa nai. Doro? Eh? Abunai desu ne. Rule of thumb don't talk about ramen as you run across a mud field. Abunai. This is kind of a strange place, don't you think? 
But yeah, what they were saying there is the place known for their ramen. Eh? Whoa, whoa, there's a lot in here. Omoshiroi. Tonkotsu ramen. Kyushu wa oi desu ne. So desu ne, tashita. Yeah, a lot of tonkotsu ramen in Kyushu, especially in Fukuoka. Takaraga. Aruso desu. Bad. Sapphire. Sapphire. Very nice. Hokaniwa. Arione. Looks like there's more treasures as well. By the way, anyone just joining, feel free to uh, chat in Japanese or English. Any language is okay. Well, mostly those two languages, but really any language if you speak just a little bit is okay. I am a Japanese teacher. This is a channel for learning Japanese through games, so feel free to uh, follow if that's what you're into. Nice! Bakudan. Bakudan ya. Bomb arrows. Bakudan means bomb. Ya means arrow. Gogo sumide. So that's like gogo violet. So like speed violet. Increases your movement speed. Iro sokuro ga agaru kouka o erareru. So you can get an effect of increasing movement speed. Ido means movement, sokuro means speed, and agaru means it can go up. I'm surprised you have Rakuen, Lakuen on the word list. If you had seen us play through Xenoblade 2, you would not be surprised. <laughs> Bakudan. Good question. Is Bakudan on the list? I think it might not be. Bald Ridge. Let's check since you've asked. That is a good question. Uh, let's go check out what we have there. So anyone can check our list. Which is our power level. Um, see, someone is here right now. An anonymous rac raccoon is in here. But let's search for Bakudan. I think we have not learned it. Pretty sure, but not positive. Because we've learned a lot of words. It's hard to remember all of them. Baku. Da. Hmm. Yeah, Bakudan. No. No Bakudan. Let's add Bakudan since you mentioned it. Bakudan. Any other words we should add now that we're here? Bakudan. Yeah, Lakuen. The reason I say that, Gade, Lak Lakuen Paradise was the goal for pretty much the whole game in Xenoblade 2. So it was our goal the whole game, the main keyword of the game. So we kind of had to learn it for that game. Bakudan. Bomb. So let's add Bomb. Lakuen. Say hi. Homura. Yeah, all of those keywords from that game, we added a lot of those keywords. Sekaiju. World tree. Words like that. So, Bakudan. Uh, because I like the word, I kind of want to add another type of bomb. So, let's look at more words related to bomb. Bakudan seime. Bombshell announcement. Bakudan teikiyatsu. Bomb cyclone, or explosive low pressure system. Um, Hapyo, bombshell announcement. What else do we have? So not that many. But I kind of like this word. Or I think it's useful to learn anyway. Uh, kaku bakudan. Nuclear weapon. Because weapon. Uh, kaku means nucleus. If you just look at the kanji for that word here. Kaku, nucleus, core, kernel, put it together. Kaku bakudan, nuclear weapon. Not a super common word, as you can see. Um, it doesn't say common, but I still think it's useful to learn. It can help you learn bakudan as well. So, bakudan, kaku bakudan, nuclear weapon. Have we learned Bakuhatsu? That's another question. Uh, why don't we learn five words 
about bombs and related to bombs. Bakuhatsu means to explode. And we've seen that in the game, but let's see if we've learned that. Bakuhatsu. Bakuhatsu. We have not learned it, so let's add that as well. Bakuhatsu to explode. Any more words you can think of? So Genbaku, Gare says. So that's also atomic bomb. Yeah, Genbaku as well. Yeah, that one actually might be more common. Genbaku. But I like the sound of Kakubakudan. Atomic bomb. Yeah, we could add that one too. Well, I mean, it's, it's probably a better suggestion in a way than the one I said. But yeah, any more suggestions about bombs? Bakudan ni tsuite no tango o benkyou shimashou. Hoka no idea ga arimasu ka? Any more ideas about words we could learn? So bakuhatsu to explode. Bakuen. So yeah, bakuen is a good suggestion. So en is like this smoke, so like the bomb of a smoke. Bakuhatsu ni yoru keimuri. Yeah, keimuri actually might be a good word. Just learning smoke, maybe. Keimuri de itomoimasu. I think just learning keimuri would be good. Because we have not learned that yet. So bakuhatsu, explosion. And then... Keimuri. Uh, bakuretsu. The only other baku word I know is bakuretsu. Not super common. Yeah, that's not super common. Exploding. But I think keimuri could be good. We've not learned that yet. Keimuri, smoke, fumes. Mohitotsu no tango ga hitsuyo desu ne. We need one more word related to bakudan, kaku bakudan, bakuhatsu, keimuri. How about hosha no? <laughs> Radiation. If we're going to have a bak kaku bakudan, we can learn radiation as well. Ho, sha, no. Ho, sha, no. Radioactivity. Ho, sha, no is radioactivity. So why don't we add that? You're just typing it? Nice. Let's, let's definitely add that then. I kind of had a running joke one time. I went to a Japanese language camp one time and everyone kept saying this word all the time. Hoshano, Hoshano, Hoshano. Because it was kind of a difficult word that people would just kept saying and it kind of became like a meme. Uh, bakusui. Let's look at that word. Bakusui. Fast asleep. Interesting. Omoshiroi desu ne. Bakusui. Bakusui suru skoshi no koto de dewa. Good eye. Ah, so very deep sleep. Bakuen. Yeah, Bakuen is a good one too. Bakusho. Bakusho, yeah, that's a good one. Bakusho. A roar of laughter. Yeah, Bakusho, I like that one. Hoshano. For this one more, just related to the theme of bombs, we can add Hoshano, radioactivity. But maybe some more things with Baku could be interesting, like Bakusho. Let's just type in Baku to the dictionary and see what we see. Baku. Baku, Ex exclamation, burst of laughter, bakuhatsu, explosion, bakudan, bomb, bakuha, destructive blast, bakugeki, bombing, bakusho, like you wrote there, roar of laughter. I just got here. Why are we learning the word radioactivity? Uh, it's a long story, Riger Zero. But basically what we do on this channel is we learn Japanese from the video games we play and sometimes 
Based on that, we have a discussion in chat about other words related to those words. And so we learned Bakudan because we got bomb arrows. So that's how it all started with bomb arrows. We had a treasure. It was bomb arrows. Then we learned the word for bomb, which is Bakudan. Then we learned the word for Bakuhatsu, which is explosion. That led to Kakubakudan, nuclear weapon. And then Hoshano, radioactivity, to answer your question. Bakusho, Bakufu, Bakuyaku which is explosive powder, bakuhatsuteki, explosive, bomb warning, so yokoku means warning, bakusui, sleeping like a log. So these are a little more rare, so I don't think we'll add them right now, but it's a good discussion to have anyway. It can at least help you learn the word baku, which basically means explosion. Bakuon, explosion sound. Bakufu is a blast. Fu is like wind, so the wind from the blast. Yeah, thank you, Shua. Bakufu. Bakushi. It's a bomb victim. So a lot of words involving explosion, if you look at it. Ippai arimasu ne. Baku no tango ga ippai arimasu. Okay, for now, let's bring it back to the game. These might not be the best words that I picked, but... uh. For now, it'll have to be good enough. 585. So Bakudan, bomb, Kaku Bakudan, nuclear weapon, Bakuatsu, explosion, Kemuri, smoke. I'll change the hiragana here later. And then Hoshano, radioactivity. Let's make our power level go up. 585. So all those words are increasing our power level in Japanese. So let's make that power level go up. Vegeta, what does the scouter say about his power level? What does the scouter says? The scouter says our power level is now 585. So yeah, the reason we started all this was because we just acquired these bomb arrows. Bakudan ya. Bomb arrows. Ya means arrow. Bakudan means bomb. Dekimashitane. By the way, Riger Zeal, uh, Zero, welcome. Japanese Quest the way Yokozo. Welcome to Japanese Quest. Yeah, we learn words from the game, but also from each other. The idea with this channel is we're on a journey together. We're all party members on this journey. Anyone who follows can become a party member. And as we find new words in the game, our power level goes up on this journey. And we can also teach each other things. So like Shua is here. Shua is from Japan, so they have a lot of suggestions. Other people do too. Ah, oh, koi. So this ne Takusan Animas. Lots of words for Baku. I need our flight power back. Koi. So are all the other arrow types written in katakana? I'm not sure. Let's check. No, I didn't think they were. So they're mostly using kanji. So kinoya, wooden arrow. Hononoya, flame arrow. Korinoya, ice arrow. Kodai heiso, ya. So guardian arrow. And uh, or an ancient arrow it's called in English, I believe. And bakudanya. I'm not sure why they used katakana there, to be honest. Uh, it could be that the kanji was just a little trickier and they wanted to make it easier. That could be why. Nago-chan, konnichiwa. Ah, Dave Ling TV. Konnichiwa. Japanese Quest away. Yokoso. Welcome to Japanese Quest. If you're just joining us, Dave Ling, uh, what we do here... Wow, there's some strong wind here. What? What we do here is we learn Japanese from Japanese games. I'm a Japanese teacher based in the U.S., and what we do here is, uh, as the best that we can, we teach each other in chat, and I teach the best I can through, the, through Japanese games. The idea is... The idea came out of... I went on a trip with students to Japan, 
And I kind of thought that was the best way to learn Japanese. And I thought, even if we're not in Japan, we can still go, go to Japan in a way, a kind of virtual Japan through Japanese games. So that's what we do here on this channel. Game of Nihongo. We're all studying Japanese through the adventure, through the game. So good to see you, Dave. Welcome. And yeah, anyone in chat? English is fine, Japanese is fine. Eigo demo, Nihongo demo, okay des. France go demo, okay des. My power level in French. I want my power level in French to go up. Our power level in Japanese on this quest, you can see in the bottom right. That's 585, all the words we've learned so far on this journey, on this channel, together has been 585 Japanese words. And we can learn more. Interesting concept. Kono concept konsepto wa omoshiroi desu. Suki suki. Arigato. I agree. That is what I was hoping for. I was hoping that I was hoping to make a basically I wanted to make a channel that I would want to see. A channel with a concept that I would want to watch. And so I made it, hoped other people might like it. We will see. Shiwa says, Kado kara tsugi tsugi ni monster ni henkei suru yo ga tobidasu no de sono yo bakumaru to natsuketa. Yo desu. Ah, yeah, nice music too, right? Ah, yokozo! Japanese Quest away. Welcome to Japanese Quest. Thanks for the follow. We now have a new party member by the name of Dave or Dave Ling TV. Yokozo! Japanese Quest away. Ishoni ni ganbaro. Yap da. So the, the map of the surrounding area has been added. So one thing we do in Japanese Quest is uh, we break down Japanese sentences as we see them. So shuhen means surrounding. And then suika means added. Mapu, of course, means map. So the surrounding map was added to our shika slate. And for anyone just joining, so our power level currently is 585, but of course the goal is for this power level to keep going up. And eventually, of course, over 9,000 is the goal. It's good to have a clear, concrete goal when you're studying a language. So over 9,000, that is one goal we have on this channel. Long way to go, but together, anything is possible. Ishoni. What is that? Ah. Kowaiatsu. It looks like we got a camel. We've got like a mech camel out there somewhere. Bakugan. Ah, Bakugan. Is that. I've heard Bakugan before. I feel like from like Naruto or something too. Well, that's Byakugan, I think, actually. Is it? I'm not a Naruto expert. Not sure. Ooh, I see a shrine of some kind. Let's try to go there. Anything else interesting up here? Yep. 
Yeah, Byakugan. Thank you, got it. So Gan, again, must mean like the eye, right? Because Gan means eye. And he's using his eye for those techniques, I'm sure. What's down here? Kore wa nan desu ka? Omoshiroso. Like a camel. Yeah. Does look like a camel. Rakuda desu ne. Robo rakuda. It's like a robot camel. Tobo, let us fly. We can see the uh, camel over there. Sugoisne. Ah, Machimo. Arimasne. Kind of in the distance, we can see that town there. Machi ga aru yo ne. Ah, hokura. Umayano. Get another stables. Nice. Keinoi no hokara. Shirabaru to examine. So when you have a, a weapon that has an attack and you do a combo, you can get an effect from that. Hachigatsu Osaka ni ita koto ga arimasu. I've been to Osaka. There's a lot to do there, so that's really cool that you'll be there at high school. Gambate kuzai. Nihon ni ita koto ga arimasu ka? Utsu to fire. Shua says in Japanese, Are oh, you coming to Osaka? People there are very friendly. Totemo friendly, friendly de akarui kataga oi desu. So a lot of friendly, bright people are there. Ah, so Nago, Nago chan says, Hearing about Osaka makes me want to eat takoyaki, which is one thing they're famous for in Osaka. I love that word waku waku for being excited about something. Waku waku shitemasne. I would be too, that is awesome. Are Naga. Um, 
are Nagashiro and Surefire Japanese. Yeah, they are. And they are married, too, I believe. If it's, if it's the people you're talking about. I think it's a married couple who streams. Shua-san is a streamer, and they often stream together. Tell me if I'm wrong, but... Hi. Yeah, Weldis. Weldis here is from Tunisia. Studying Japanese in Tunisia. Just started studying uh, hiragana this week, I believe. This yellow ball is takoyaki. Kano wa kano. Kano wa kano mo nihonjin desu ka? I think Kanoa Kano might be Japanese as well. I could be wrong. Sorry if I am wrong. Kanoa Kano wa Nihonjin desu ne chigao desu. Chigaimasu ka? Uh, Gare says, I've been trying to parse Shua sentences. <laughs> uh, Welder says, yeah, I left my studies aside to learn Japanese. We live in Tokyo. Ah, uh, so this net. Kumamoto. Ah, Kumamoto. Yeah, I think we probably talked about that before, right? Kumamoto ni ita koto ga arimasu. I have been to Kumamoto. I think we probably talked about Kumamon before. The character from Kumamoto. Kumamon wa. Kawaii. Chisana kagi. So we have a small key. So yeah, well this so Shua and So we have three people in chat I believe right now that at least that are Japanese. Dave says your previous comment, I'm trying to truly, truly trying to learn Japanese, so it helps me keep going. Nice. Yishu ni ganbaro. Nihongo de eigo de prosecutive de seki de ganbarimashou. I need some water. Mitsu de. Sometimes I talk too much and I need water. <laughs> I feel honored to be with Japanese in the same chat. Yeah, there's often Japanese people here. Well, this. Gambarimasho. Nanakorobi yaoki. So desu yo ne. Yeah, if you guys don't know that, uh. That phrase that Kanawa Kano just said, it means fall seven times, get up eight. And what it means is you just gotta keep going, keep trying. No matter how many times you fail, you keep persevering. Nana Korobi, Yaoki. Nana Korobi, Yaoki. Mizuga oishi desu yo. So Shua is saying here that they mi mixed up the readings between Bakudan and Bakugan. So Bakugan wa. So Bakugan is from a game. It's in a game title. And that's what they're talking about before. Ganbaro. Ishoni Ganbaro. Yeah, for anyone just joining. To give you a full vision of what this channel does, let me quick just say it. So right now we are all of us on a journey through video game Japan. We started with Xenoblade Chronicles 2. If you want to find the old videos, they're here on Twitch and YouTube as well. We played some Celeste, we played some Mario Odyssey, we played through Harry Potter in Japanese. Right now, this is where we are. We're in Breath of the Wild. Eventually, we'll play other games. And the idea is that 
when you go into Japanese language Japan, it's one way of visiting Japan in a sense. This is the Japan map. So Kumamoto is here, so one of the people in chat right now. Um, Kano wa Kano is in Kumamoto. Check it out. Mitte kudasai. Kumamoto. So this is where Kano wa Kano lives. Shuo-san and Nago-chan live in Tokyo. When I lived in Japan, I lived here in Yamaguchi Prefecture. Uh, last summer, I went to Sapporo. But the idea is, as you travel through video game Japan, you are also traveling through Japanese language Japan. And the deeper we go together on this journey through video game Japan, we also will make progress in Japanese language Japan. Starting out with some easier words, some easier grammar, eventually get to higher levels, and three, and two, eventually maybe, and one, the highest level of the Japanese proficiency test, and eventually maybe, you know, even higher too. You can definitely go higher than N1. I passed N1 a few years ago, but, you know, we can go higher than that. We'll see. We'll take time. It's a journey, but we're on this journey together. So anyone who joins the party, anyone who follows, is with us on this journey, and as we progress, we can travel through video game Japan and through Japanese language Japan, and we can level up in Japanese as we level up in the game. The idea is, if you combine all these games, think about it. All the games that have ever been made, the area is as great, it's as big, it's bigger than Japan. The number of people, more people too. And new games get made all the time. So through these games, we can kind of have a virtual Japan and learn through that. That's the goal of this channel anyway. Ishoni. Tabishio. Let's go on a journey. That's the concept of this channel. What does the scouter say about his power level? The scouter says our power level is almost 9,000. Mosuge. Griffin Sensei. Kawaii desu ne, so desu yo ne. Totemo kawaii. Ah, there's a big earthquake in Kumamoto. Naru horo. Daijoubu deshita ka? So yeah, were you okay? Shuo is asking if... If, um, Kano wa Kano is okay during the earthquake. Kata. So they were, they said they were okay. So that's good to hear. Kodai no neji. Kodai no haguruma. So we got an ancient screw and an ancient gear. And it looks like we have to some... So uh, we just saw that word for gear. Haguruma. We gotta get these gears working. It's not, this one's not very difficult, is it? <laughs> I wanted to see if it hurt. It did not look safe. Examine. Shit about it. Bidi bidi. Yeah. Itai desu ne. Bidi bidi. An electric shock. <laughs> I wanted to know. Shiritakatta. Kodomo no yoni. So Dave says. To Gare. Shushin wa doko. So where are you from, Gare? 
克服の証できましたね So, 克服の証 literally means like the proof that we overcame the trial. In English, it's called the spirit orb. They kind of changed the translation there. Yeah, Shua said when Japanese people are hurt, Nihon Jin wa itai toki ni itatata to iu koto ga arimasu. Yeah, that's what Japanese people say when they get hurt. So, itai means hurt, but they just say it itatata. もうすぐ強くなるそうですねもうすぐオッケー、I think we still want to go here ほくらがあると思います So ガレイ says I'm from East Coast USA East Coast Best Coast ラスカティブの出身はどこですか Where are you from ラスカティブ Dave Ling says, cool. I'm in the East Coast pretty often. East Coast. Those cities you mentioned are West Coast. East Coast is like New York, Boston. Kinishinai, don't worry about it.、Uh, one focus of this channel, we try to make mistakes as much as possible because mistakes actually really help you learn. And not just you. So, like, you probably knew that and whatever, it's fine. <laughs> so, it doesn't really matter to make that mistake. But, like, from you saying that and making that mistake, other people watching can learn from that. So, we try to make mistakes as much as possible on this channel. We try to fail as much as possible. Like, I do too. I fail all the time. And it's really good to fail. So, I highly recommend failing more if you can, on this channel especially. We can learn from that. So, my goal is to start failing more. I've probably succeeded too much today. I'm getting too good at this game. I've got to fail more at the game and the language. Then we can learn more. So,、uh, Dave, Shushin wa doko desu ka? Where are you from? どこの出身ですか<笑> So, r u s k a t i v やっぱり、East Coast ですね、also from East Coast <笑> Yeah, I feel like I used to mix up East Coast and West Coast maybe more, but I feel like now I have such a, set, a strong sense of East Coast equals New York, Boston West Coast equals LA, San Francisco, that I don't really forget it now because I just have such a strong association with that. Ah, Mexico Jin des. Ah, なるほど You are from Mexico. Mexico no doko. So, where in Mexico? Yeah, I feel like, especially if you're not from the US, the coasts would be easier to forget then because you just don't probably talk about it quite as much. メキシコのどこに住んでますか So, where in Mexico do you live? Not that I will necessarily know all the cities, but. そうですよね。Well put, Ruskative. We can level up in many different ways. Well, where are we? えマップが亡くなった。怖い。なんで。何も見えない。砂嵐。So we get like a sandstorm, which I believe is 砂嵐。砂 means sand、嵐 means storm。大変ですね。キラキラキラ。Yeah, I've gotten the sandstorm. Where in the world is this shrine? I should have paid more attention to when we were gliding.
あ、ダゴチョンスズ、タコスが大好きです。<笑>大大大好きです。So she love, love, love tacos. Nice. I also do. I love tacos as well. <laughs> I cannot see anything here. Ooh, but we got some minerals. So, this is Chua san. That's what it seems like. Because of the sandstorm, the radar does not work anymore. Kohaku. Some amber, Kohaku. Topaz. Poka Puck Poka Habu. So it's a, a of an herb that warms you up. ギャルド地方など気温の高い場所で育つ薬草の一種。So one type of a plant or herb that you can get from high temperature areas such as the ギャルド region。ミヤハは、um, カラアジ成分が強く。So it's very spicy。料理に使うと、so if you use it for cooking、寒さに強くなる。You can become stronger against coldness. Koka o erikoto ga dekiru. Naru ho ro. Benly desu ne. Ah! ルザルフスのキロシポ。So、we got a yellow tail. We had a normal tail from a lizard. Now we have a yellow tail.、Uh, なるほど。薬の材料としては重宝されている。So it's, it's、uh, valuable for ingredients for medicine. いいですね。So Shua says, if you want to say laugh, 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 just do, yeah, www to show lol in Japanese to show that you're laughing. Perhaps you already knew that, Dave Ling. <laughs> yep, it looks like Dave Ling already knew it. Shitemasne. Kohaku. Ganen, rock salt, kohaku, kohaku, lots of amber. Koko wa doko? Where are we? Hmm. Let's use up some of these spears. あ、怖い。あ、痛い。えー、そんなに痛いの。強い。Why is this guy so strong? What was that all about? I died because of what she said. Died of laugh laughter. <laughs> 死ぬ。<laughs> 爆笑。危ないけど、矢が必要ですね。お願いします。矢、取ります。ありますかえ
Hey, the sandstorm stopped. So we can see the shrine now. Eh? Sunarashi ga yanda. これは変なやつが出たね。あ、ほら、あります。え、someone was here. There's a fire. Ayashi. She had it. Let's investigate. <laughs> I died because of what she said. Died of laughter. Bakusho de shinda. Omae wa mo shindeiru. Bakusho de. So you can die with laughter. Yeah, in English, there's a kind of expression you can die from laughter. Like I can kind of die from laughter. Naruhoro, rikaishimashita, so you understand. Wakamore. So you're jealous that he that he can eat guacamole anytime. <laughs> Omoshiroi. <laughs> wakamore toka itsu demo. <laughs> w I agree with those W's. <laughs> so what do we have here? Forgot to read the title of this shrine. Nani kore? Kata. Yo, why this ne? These things are weak. They gotta get some proper guardians in these temples. Nani kore? <laughs> so you make tacos at home? I also make tacos, often soft tacos. I think if we still have it on the line, we can still power this thing, so that should work. Whoa, that was bad. Eh? Hmm. Must find a better solution. He makes octopus at home. Hi, <laughs> honto So yes, they actually do make octopus at home. Tacos. Moikai Taco. Mina, she's one got him. Taco no. 
タコズを作ったことがありますか The real question is, have you ever made taco tacos? Tacos with octopus. That is the true question. What do we have here? Taco taco, exactly, Dave. Let's get to some high level tacos <laughs> that you eat only for their pun value, not for their flavor. I have made an octopus taco. Really? Ruskative, I would expect nothing less from you. You probably did it. Just for the pure wit factor. Was it good? Doratta. Oishi. Katta. This is very high level taco stash house that we're talking about here. Tsukutta koto arimasen. So Kira Kira has not made it. Nor have I. Ruskative, however, has. Kodai no Koa, ancient core. Very nice. It was so good, it didn't exist. It was too good to be true. <laughs> Naruhodo. Sure, what to do here? Koryo, Sky Marshall. Let's try to use this in something. Something. Ah, we're somewhere. And we activated this. Naruto, Imakara. Hi. Quesadillas are awesome. Oishi desu yo. Oh no, of course we need something up here too. I think anyone would know what a quesadilla is. I don't think anyone would know. Yep, maybe not, I don't know. Mochi don't ski des. Quesadilla, ski. Oh, she don't ski. Yeah, I don't know anyone who does not like a quesadilla. Quesadilla is like. Everyone will like that. Oh no, can we not go up now? Or do we can't? Daremo, quesadilla ga. Ski desu ne. Oishii kara.
Yeah, since Shuo is in Tokyo, there's tons of restaurants that have good Mexican food. Very lucky. Oh, here we go. Kori o tsukaimasu ne. Burrito mo tsuki desu, watashi mo. Eh! Nande! Abune. What in the world happened there? I was thinking too much about burritos and not enough about the game. So I guess we need to move that or something? Let's get more energy back. Abunai. <laughs> yes, I was talking too much about burritos there. So what is my favorite food? Sa. Muzukashi shitsumon desu ne. Na Nihon de wa ichiban tsuki na tabemono wa ramen ya sukiyaki desu ne. Okonomiyaki mo tsuki desu. Eh? Yatta. But I also love Indian food. I love pizza. I love Italian food. I love Mexican food. Like um, enchiladas are really, really good. I love a lot of food. Indo yori mo pizza mo Mexico yori mo daisuki desu. Yeah, sukiyaki is the best. Okonomiyaki mo daisuki. We have the spirit orb for conquering the temple of tacos. So I feel like we're talking about food the whole time here. So we can call it the tacos no hokura. The temple of tacos. Kuriyashimashita. I feel like since we've talked about it so much, it's important that we commemorate this on our journey. I feel like Link now should be holding a big taco. Let's make a taco here. Let's see how well I can draw a taco. So taco kind of has this shape, right? Takozu kakimashou. So takozu koyatte. Hokano Koremo Skymas Korewa Takozu Oishi Disney Demo Koremo a Tomato Toka Mo Haitemas Tashikani Kokoa Atsuisne, it seems pretty hot here. This really folds my tacos. So now we can run around, but not for long. This place is too hot for us. Mexico ni ikenakya. Yeah, I definitely want to go to Mexico. I recommend you do. I've been to Mexico. Good place to visit. この怪しいものは何ですかえ。止まってください。Please stop. え、なんで待って、待って。
待ってください。待ってください。ほら、こら。待って。すき焼き。えー、なんで待ってくださいちょっと待って早いよしつくまった We're now riding a walrus which I recommend you do if you ever go to Mexico Check out our taco. Eh, cool. I like how on this divine beast is a taco. So if we get onto it, we can find the taco. Shinju ni nori konde. タコズを探すなくちゃ。真珠の中にきっとタコズがありますね。危ない。カラカラバザール。So we made it to an oasis. Hopefully, it's not too hot here because we were getting killed out here. Some taco is interesting. Yep. Don't worry, the taco is still here. But I'm going to erase that for now. Let's look around. Konnichiwa. あ、犬。可愛い,いですね。ワンちゃんは。There's a memory around the bazaar. え、どこ？記憶はどこですか？ We must find it. There's beetle. In Japanese, Teddy. The taco will always remain in our hearts. そうですね。心でタコスがあります。永遠に、forever。永遠のタコ、永遠のタコス。Hey! こんにちは。So we got got a nice selection of lizard tails and whatnot. Hmm. 記憶はどこですか So we're looking for our memory. Let's、uh, look at our picture. Just a bit outside of it, like on the road to the bazaar rather than the actual bazaar. Okay, let's look at the picture. ここですね So yeah, it's on one side of the lake. 池の隣ですね And facing that, so it must be. あそこ Konnichiwa. Konohen? Probably around here, right? Ah! Arimas ne. Nimasho. So I am thinking we're gonna end the stream here in a little bit.、Uh, so I will write the time, we'll start the next stream. Which is eight o'clock. Ashita mo hachiji kara haishin shimas. Go go hachiji desu ne. So the central time, eight p.m. We will stream again tomorrow. 
So I will say... Matane. We will watch this memory, but then we'll translate the memory tomorrow and learn some new words from that memory as we break down the Japanese. Matane. Kyo wa tanoshikatta. But let's look at the memory, and then I will host someone too. We always host someone who streams Japanese games or teaches Japanese or who is Japanese. So let's all look at the memory. And then... Let's host someone. Ishu ni mimashou. Kyo wa tanoshikatta. Ishu ni kyoku wo mimashou. Let's take a look at the memory now. I will find someone to host. So next time on Japanese Quest, we will translate that memory. We'll take a look at that memory. From 8 o'clock tomorrow in Japan, from 10 o'clock in the morning. Nihon de wa juji kara haishin shimasu ne. Kyo wa tanoshikatta. Welcome to everyone who joined. Anyone else watching, feel free to follow. You can join us on this journey tomorrow as we travel deeper into Japanese games, deeper into the Breath of the Wild, and deeper into the Japanese language. And I think we will host, since Dave, since you asked, host my friend. Uh, who is your friend? Like you said, Japanglish. So actually, someone named Japanglish is streaming. So I think I will host Japanglish. I'm not sure if that's who you meant. But there's no dialogue in it to translate? Oh, was there no dialogue at all? Really? Okay. Oh, well. Then I guess I won't translate that tomorrow. But anyway, um, so... I thought you meant Japanglish. Oh, you mean Hiso. Uh, yeah, we have hosted Hiso before. I thought you meant Japanglish, so I actually am going to host Japanglish because I got it set up already. So we will host Japanglish, but anyone else want to check out Hiso? He's a streamer also who's, who talks Japanese and English. So does Japanglish. This is who I thought you meant. So you can find a new streamer. They are currently streaming real life in Japan. So let's all go to Japan together. Sa. Hosto de minna isho ni. Let's all go to Japan together through Twitch, through hosting this person. Let's go to Japan together through Twitch, through hosting this person.